In this production update, we're going to take you on a little ride trying to get ready to submit to the Sundance Film Festival. We've been jamming really hard uh, to make the Sundance deadline, so we've been trying to get a rough cut together. We've got an extension for Sundance, and it is in about three days that we have to submit. Bob Hawk, who, who has connections at Sundance, uh, helped us get an extension uh, on the festival because there was no way we were going to be ready by the regular deadline. And the film is not quite ready yet. There's still a few holes in it. And we have to uh, also submit it to two advisors to look at so they can give us some feedback before we um, send it to Sundance. We've been so busy actually cutting the movie that we haven't had an opportunity to, to see our results. It's a different experience to, to work on individual pieces and then to see it as a whole piece. I edit mostly on my laptop these days and I go to a cafe because my apartment is getting taken over by lots of people. We were supposed to have it in by tomorrow, but um, last week uh, we got an extension to our extension. It was sort of a miraculous demonstration, as my mom would say. When we were getting up against the deadline, we had such devastating output problems getting it out of the Avid into DVD that uh, twice in a row we missed the FedEx deadline. Just as we were finding out we were going to miss FedEx, I got an unsolicited email from the Sundance Film Festival programmer, and they very generously gave us an extra six days, and that sort of saved us. We postponed twice at least getting the DVD to Bob Hawk, our consultant. And once again, we're stymied by our output. Paul is calling Bob Hawk to reschedule the drop-off of the DVD for review. Saturday, 7 p.m. is the cutoff for Sundance. And that's it. We have no more extensions on this going out. So we sent it out to Bob Hawk and also my cousin, Vince Sherry, who, who's a producer for Forensic Files and has gives very good notes as well. The notes I get from uh, Vince are the opening is terrible, it's got to change, you know, I don't understand what's going on, you got to move this up, and the notes from Bob were even worse. And basically he said we were not ready to submit to Sundance and he recommended we did not, we do not submit to Sundance. So that was pretty upsetting for us, that was a real wake-up call. On the other hand, we have been making such outrageous pro progress, every day the movie completely changes. And, uh, and I felt that we were on the, on the verge of making a breakthrough and that we could get it, get it in shape uh, in time. This morning I just came up with a, a totally new idea based on Vince's notes and based on Bob's notes, Bob's notes of how to restructure the beginning and, uh, and start it differently. And we just watched it and uh, we think it's working. We have about 24 hours to uh, get this together and get it to Bob. And we're getting out, as my cousin Vince says, we're getting out the machete. Uh, so this is a two hour and 15 minute cut. We're going to try to get it down to, to 90 minutes. So we're going to cut out 40, 45 minutes from the movie.